have chess start in a second here, but uh, I just want to let the, the, the crew from the ACM out of YSU here give a little, just like a little short talk about, they have a robotics challenge coming up, and uh, after they're done, then we'll have chess start. So I can't get up and talk about like sea shell and all. <laughs> <laughs> Take your best shot, buddy. <laughs> Yeah, it gets bad, rap. It's not as bad as, uh, I think it's not as bad as they, they, they cut out the beat. Um, our, we're, we're doing a uh, robotics challenge for Northeast Ohio. Um, and it's a, a special kind of a challenge because um, it's, it's a little bit different than the, your, your typical robot competition where you have folks that have an even playing field and they're kind of competing, competing, you know, it's not like a the bot, uh, battles or the robot soccer and those kinds of uh, uh, things. Uh, this is more of a challenge, and there are actually some um, um, pretty hard uh, problems that we're trying to solve with uh, robotics. And so this CSI uh, Clue Robotics Challenge, we just want to get one point across that it's not a, like a competition. It's really, you really want to think about it more along the lines of something like a, uh, a DARPA uh, challenge. You, you know, there's some serious stuff going on here. Um, we are having a kickoff uh, for this thing in, uh, at Akron University on, on September the 6th. Uh, you guys are all invited. I mean, anyone that's interested, uh, it would be free uh, to get in. Um, I do want to say for giveaways there to hopefully draw some folks that may or may not want to come. Uh, there's going to be some uh, Raspberry Pi uh, giveaways. We're going to be giving away some uh, EV3 uh, controllers. Um, what's some of the other nice stuff? Yeah, some t-shirts, some books. Um, uh, there's going to be some book signings there. Yeah, so it's, it's a few things that's going to be going on. Um, and at that uh, talk, we, we tried to cover as much as we can cover on this little flyer here. Uh, a guy named Koenig is a uh, big time uh, artificial intelligence robotics guy is going to be doing a pretty uh, um, effective talk out there. Um, so we want to invite you to that. But we're also looking for any of you guys that are and gals that are interested um, in potentially participating on any of the robot teams uh, that we're going to have in this uh, competition. If you are interested in uh, robot building at any level, you know, the circuits, the soldering, the, um, the design, uh, the simulations, uh, uh, the Linux operating system, a, a lot of the uh, platforms that we're looking at are going to be uh, Linux driven uh, platforms. Uh, the uh, the form factor stuff, uh, any anything at the software level. If any of you guys are, are interested in uh, vision, uh, we have some serious vi uh, machine vision issues that we are uh, trying to grapple with. Uh, there are obvious navigation issues uh, that we are trying to deal with. Uh, there's a high artificial intelligence uh, component to this. So for the folks that um, might be interested in agent-oriented programming, uh, there's a, a good degree of uh, that kind of stuff that's going on there. Um, in addition to the just the hardware of the robotics uh, and the artificial intelligence type software programming, there's also a big uh, component of uh, communication because these robots have to work in a team environment. So. Uh, you know, if you've got skills uh, with respect to Bluetooth type programming between um, devices, uh, you know, your, your normal uh, wireless type programming, um, we have that kind of component. There's also a component where we're dealing with the uh, human robot interface. And so part of the challenge that we are um, trying to tackle is. Uh, having the ability for the humans to be able to use the kind of communication that they need to use um, and the robots have the capacity to be able to uh, get some of that level of communication. So you don't want to have the human uh, team members having to go drop down into things that are uh, complicated at the uh, robot level. So it's just all kinds of 
it's all kind of levels that we're looking for participation in, in this uh, uh, challenge. Um, and not just on the robot end, um, we need uh, folks that are just like organizers, uh, people that are interested in uh, maybe being team leaders, uh, cheerleaders. Uh, uh, if any of you are millionaires or billionaires, <laughs> we're looking for the money part of it too. Um, we, we have a, a pretty nice foundation of interested parties at all levels of this already, but not enough. You know, we have maybe 15 or 20 people that are interested in various aspects of this. Um, and ideally, we would like to have as many as two to four teams. And right now, we've only got like enough for a one and a half team. Um, so at the kickoff, we're going to part. Part of the goal of the kickoff is to to make everyone aware of this event and to possibly get people that want to participate. Um, and at all kinds of levels. Uh, and there's no. Um, we're looking largely for people who are passionate about this. Uh, the other thing about this robot challenge is. This is largely not something for high school uh, kids and really not just for uh, college students. Uh, college students are uh, obviously invited and are welcome. Um, and it's a little too much for, uh, if you're not in college, it's a little bit too much unless you're really, really bright. Uh, we won't turn you away. This is really meant for uh, professionals, hobbyists, people that are just interested in this kind of stuff. Um, from the community, people who are inventors, closet inventors, uh, midnight engineers, uh, that kind of group uh, of folks. So we imagine that maybe people in the, uh, this group right here um, would, would be good candidates for this, this kind of challenge. And since we are representing um, Northeast Ohio uh, in this, we're trying to get coalitions with our, our different groups in Northeast Ohio um, we have a couple of small businesses that are involved. Like I said, we're working with the uh, the ACM, the Northeast Ohio ACM, um, and the Columbus uh, ACM now. Uh, uh, we're getting ready to get with them. The IEEE and Akron, uh, those guys have just uh, joined in. The IEEE uh, and Youngstown State University, they're just joined in. So it's just going to be a coalition. Um, and we're hoping that as many of you as can uh, come to this event in, uh, in September. Um, I think it's going to be, what, three hours, maybe, or three and a half hours. We're going to have lightning talks there, too. Um, and so what that is for, for you all that may be new to that is we're going to have three to five slots that are just be open. And anyone from the audience that has something that they want to talk about and if they can fit it into three or five minutes and it is relevant to either robotics, artificial intelligence, uh, crime scene investigation, or the clue game. It could be any one of those topics. Uh, if you get there in time, it's a first come first serve uh, deal on these, uh, on these lightning talks. You'll have opportunity to present whatever you uh, are brave enough to uh, uh, you know, whatever you're brave enough to, to uh, present. And I don't want to take any more time. Did anyone have any questions that I could a a answer? How long would the actual building of the robot be? Um, the, the kickoff is in September. We're going to put together the teams, and the, the teams themselves are really kind of going to decide how long the, you know, the, the robot build process is going to be. We want to have this thing take place in 2015 at some point. Um, but we have to see what happens. You know, if it's the kind of thing where we get two or three teams together and, you know, they need to go into 2016 for some reason, that's open. But yeah, it, it could be all next year. Um, and your, participa your participation can be at any level during that year. You, are you on the uh, email list, the Google groups? Um, no, we're not. Okay. I don't think we are, are we? Yeah. Okay. Uh, sign up for it. Just Google search, search uh, Google Groups. Okay. Linux users group. Yeah. Now, nowhere, we just joined the Akron Linux 
Okay. Music group. So this is our second time here. Okay. And so this is, you know, a cool group. <laughs> yeah. And we're going to be coming here regularly. So this once, is kind of cool. Once we signed up on the email list, okay. you can yeah. put an email out that basically gives us a whole synopsis. Oh, cool. cool. Of, you know, we have uh, websites to look at. So that we, we will do something. Mm -hmm. we'll I see a date on the flyer here. Is it here? Yeah. That's the time. <laughs> September 6th. You don't have a date on the time. Mm -hmm. Is it? Every day. Every day. <laughs> I should probably stop saving.